Um, hello. This is gonna be... Actually, I guess I should wait until after the intro. In here. I don't think this is too loud. I'm gonna lower it down just in case. Okay, so... This is gonna be my first episode of Fire Room Shadow Dragon. Which is also going to be the first let's play I'm gonna do. Um, I've never done this before. And, yeah, I mean, if you find this channel, I mean, I typically do a bunch of hero stuff whenever they release it. I don't always do it the day it comes out, but <laughs> I try to do it if I can. Because I have to, like, edit the videos and stuff and the thumbnails, and I mean, I don't know. Um, okay, I should probably talk about this. Okay, this is gonna be a blind-ish playthrough. Um, I've seen Mangs play it. I don't know if you know how it is. He's a pretty popular final YouTuber. Um, I haven't, I didn't really pay attention too much to it. I know she does good, right? Um, I know I probably should use Jagan, not using him as a pitfall, <laughs> right? <laughs> um, I honestly don't know what to do. I don't want to play it on normal. That seems a bit noobish. Uh, um, I guess I'll play hard one. I honestly have never played this game before. Um, should I do narration? I'll do it. Long ago, Medius, king of the dragonkin, conquered the continent of Arcanea, giving rise to an age of fear and despair for all its people. That tyranny was broken, however, when an unlikely hero intervened. A young man hailing from the Altea region appeared with a divine blade in hand. Fang of dragon and blade of light locked in battle, and in the end, blade prevailed. For some time after, the land enjoyed an age of peace. However, after a century's passing, the Shadow Dragon returned. He forged an alliance with a fiendish sorcerer who sought to rule the world, and their combined might toppled the toppled kingdom upon unsuspecting kingdom. Well, look, there's Nina. <laughs> Again, darkness threatened to engulf the continent. I think that's Mars' dad, right? <laughs> It fell upon the King of Altea, sole descendant of the Dragon Slayer hero, to sally forth with the Divine Blade and fulfill his blood destiny. But he was betrayed by his neighbor and ally, Gra. Gra. And both king and kingdom fell. Altea's prince, Marth, escaped the castle and found refuge on the island of Talus. But at a dear cost, his sister stayed behind to buy his freedom. I think she warped him, right? I'm not so sure. I don't really remember. Marth, Prince of Altea, was lucky. Though Dolor took from him his kingdom and all but a handful of knights, they could not take his life. Marth lived and made it to the eastern isle of Talus. Talus was a small border kingdom with no grand order of knights to boast of. But its king selflessly gave Marth use of its eastern uh, eastern fortress. As he saw the boy shake with anger and grief, he also gave wise counsel. Prince Marth, he said, I do not doubt you love your sister something great. Oh. Okay, I mean. But you must be patient. Time is on your side. If you stay here and go stronger, a time will come when you can help her. So Marsh stayed in Talus, protected by its kind people, and the years went by. It's a pretty classic map, right? <laughs> and of course, the pirates, I think, are those fighters in this game. I don't really know. Oh, look, it's Paolo, right? Yeah, green-haired Pegasus Knight. Oh no, it's Sheeta. What a thought. 
Sire, you've a visitor from the castle. It's Princess Sheeta. Sheeta, what is it? You look white as a sheet. Ha ha, very funny, Mars.
I know what. Okay. Um. Okay, I don't see Gordon doing much of anything, but that's a lot of enemies. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Sorry if you heard anything, by the way. Um, or somebody talking. That wasn't me. Just my family being kind of loud. Oh, she doubles with the javelin? Yeah, she's kind of fast. Okay, weapon weight is a thing. I don't know what's the weapon weight formula or whatever in this game. But I find it out as I go. Oh, you know what? I can give this skill to Abel. Yeah, I prefer an iron bow here. Please don't miss. Okay, good. That would have really sucked if he messed up. There we go. Another one dead. Why did Kane start with 50 experience? Or not start, but... I guess the thief gave like 50. Which isn't bad. Um, okay, I don't want to do that. If he takes so many hits, he's just going to die. This isn't that bad, though. Yeah, they're only doing like one or two damage. That's actually pretty good. Hmm. I can attack Washita from here. That doesn't seem too bad. And she could get the kill. I don't know. 65% chance to hit doesn't seem too reliable. But it keeps her out of range of the enemies. So let's try this. Damn, okay. Kill for Sheeta. What am I thought that she'd do it, but don't tell Sheeta, I guess. Okay, and we have another person here that could be killed. Okay, I don't want to give it to Kane. He's already like about to level up anyway. I think I prefer to just do this. Okay, he's doing six. With 13 attack, he's at 12. Okay, so it takes like 11 damage max. Still, I'd prefer. I think I'm gonna do this so that he can try and take some attention away from Abel. I don't want Abel dying. I thought he'll die either way, but whatever. I can have Jagan bait this. Archer. That's his range. I should probably check that. Okay, it's just this. Yeah, so healing would have really been nice, but it doesn't matter too much now. Okay, another kill from Earth. Okay, that's okay. I don't want Jagan taking too much damage here. Should probably put him on a fort. Wait, why are they going for Kane? This is well, whatever. Wow, really? <laughs> that's a great first level. Oh, okay, I guess they were just doing less damage. Okay, if Kane gets the kill, you can level up too. Or not, not Kane, Abel. We know that they've got the same defense. I guess he just went for him because he was at a lower HP. I don't really know. Okay, I don't really want to use up a javelin. Kind of want to keep one, but. I know. I can chip with Gordon. And then I don't know who I could give the kill to. 
Bobby Shida, right? Ooh, okay. It's a good level. Or at least it's decent, unlike somebody. Okay, that's a really unreliable hit, right? Are you kidding me? Okay, sorry, I th I should have made a cut there. I had to go somewhere, sorry, but I'm back. Okay, so, okay, let's see where we left off. So I think it would make the most sense to give this to Paula, she, er, not Paula, Sheeta. She hasn't gotten a kill yet. Oh, but those are some shit hit rates, oh my god. <laughs> That's not, well, okay, never mind. I guess this is going to Kane. That's solid enough. Jesus Christ, that's really bad. Okay, I want to get some kills to Sheeta. So, can she get this? I'm not chancing her life on that. Oh, you know what? If I do this and I pull back... Actually, you know what? I can just move him onto the... Doesn't even do anything. Damn. I guess I can put him onto the um, forest. Or actually, not the mountain does better. Yeah, I don't want him to kill. Okay. And I have Marth here. Jeez. Yeah, I'm gonna put him on the. Actually, I can't even put him on the fort. <laughs> okay, there we go. <clears throat> okay, go for Sheeta. Let's start moving these clowns over here. I don't have the Vulnery, do I? I'm guessing, no, that's an armory, they don't sell them there. Why does Marth have seven move? That's crazy. They have nine move? Jesus Christ. Everybody in this game has so much move. Oh no, they're moving. Wait. Oh, okay, I thought he, I thought he broke it. Or ransacked, or whatever you want to say. I thought he destroyed the village. There we go. That's what up. Okay, um, Mars got seven defense. These guys have got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay. Um, he's got twelve. He's got twelve. Okay, Mars lives, so I'm just gonna do this, and I'll leave him with the iron sword. He's doing fine, which is fine. Yeah. Um, I'll move sheet up here. I'll move in drag here. Kane, Abel, and Gordon. Alright, that's fine. And I can trip with Gordon, give that to somebody. That's fine. Probably should have just gone with the iron bow. I could have missed that. <laughs> okay, I don't plan on using Drog, so I'm just gonna have him weaken here. Like, I mean in like the long run. I don't really want to give him too much experience right now. Okay. What are her hit rates right now? They've got 82. Okay, yeah, so I'm not gonna leave her there. She's got. Eh, it's kind of shitty. I'd rather not. Let's see here. Okay, Marth can walk around. I, I do want to give that kill to Marth. So I'm gonna have Abel weaken. 
the pirate. Oh good, he missed. And I'll have Mars come here. And he can kill. You know, I might use Gordon. But honestly, I just like George more. So I'm not sure. Ooh! Oh my god, that is a great level. Okay. So here... I should probably need a kill. Okay, good. And she gets first level. Wow, okay. That's like a generic Sheeta level, right? <laughs> okay, I'll leave Kane on the fort so he can heal. Wasn't there Vulnery? Oh, it's right, it's on the boss. Okay. And I'll have Jagan visit the village. Galder. That's the harbor town west of Talus and out beyond the water. These days, a pirate by the name of Gomer calls the shots there. The whole town's at the mercy of his crew. Okay, I guess it's an interesting exposition. Um, and it's okay. Decent healing. I'll have Marth come here. Ooh! <laughs> really? I am Riss, a humble curate. I cannot fight, but this stuff I carry can heal your wounded. Take me with you and you'll be very glad you did. Okay, I am very glad. Interesting. <laughs> I didn't think I would be getting Riss. A man of the staff by the name okay, <laughs> of Riss, okay, sure. Lives in the village south of the castle. He was hoping to meet your prince. That's cool. I was just saying earlier that a healer would be nice. Damn, that's some shitty experience. Okay. Does this guy move? Okay, at this point I'm just gonna turn off ranges. No, he doesn't move. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so Gordon chip with the iron bow. Okay, good. So who do I want to get this kill to? Who's better anyway? Abel or Kane? Abel's actually got a bit more speed. I don't know, this might turn into like a Sane Kent situation where I think Sane in the end gets like the same speed, but he just has higher strength. So I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna keep on training them. Maybe Kane ends up getting better. I don't know. Let's see. I definitely wanna give it the. I think I wanna give the boss kill to Sheeta. Yuck, that is some really bad hit rate. Or not hit rate, but damage. <sighs> he kills. Damn. Okay. Okay, so he's got a D, D rank in lances. He's got a D rank in swords. Okay. I guess I'll give it to... Um, I'll give it to Kane. It doesn't really matter to. <laughs> I don't know, I'm stressing out over it, but. Okay. And I'll have. She can still reach the boss from here, so I'll just have her heal. Oh, you know, I can just throw javelins at him. <laughs> That's pretty dumb. The might have I I'll tell you, you say now. Harder. Ye sprogs look <laughs> to be a mite short of to be a mite short a mighty to me. <laughs> Jesus, he talks so weird. And I missed. Okay. Um mm -hmm. Okay. Mark. I don't want Marf to die. He's not going to though. Okay, so I've already decided to kill those Sashida, right? Yeah, she can live a hit now. 
Okay, let's see. So we got Jagan over here. He can do a decent amount, but I'm not sure that he'll hit. Can risk him over here? Yeah, he can. Okay. I, I'll go for it. Let's see. Who knows, maybe he hits. Oh, he hit. Damn. Okay, good. Okay, some stuff experience for risk. Okay, I'll use the rapier here. Even if I get a crit, Marth won't, Marth won't kill. So, yeah, okay. What's well thinking? Oh, he dodged. Okay, good. Um, Cheetah can't kill yet, right? Ah, uh, she's barely missing. But even then, she might actually just straight up miss. So, let's go for another one of these. Oh, he hit. That's great. How much does Gordon do? Two damage. He can actually kill. <laughs> I'll go for this. Let's see. Great. Okay. Now I can actually just use an Iron Lance. And that'll still kill. Nope. Never mind. But a Wing Spear will. Okay, so she just has to hit one of these. Um, in the event that she misses, I guess Kane can take the javelin. Oh no, he can't even use it. Drog can though. Okay. Might be a ballsy move, but I'll do it. Let's see. There we go. You'll, you'll pay, dog. That's not very nice. <laughs> okay. And... Okay, I'll go on there. Oh, this music is good. I recognize it. I just don't know from where. Oh, you know what? It's from the, um, the premium range. That's right. Okay. Is it worth it healing with Riss? Not really. How much nice to use? Ah, Prince Marth, you have saved us in our hour of need. Please accept my thanks. Lad, I believe ye are ready. If you wish to seek out allies in Aurelis, I will give you what soldiers I can to see you arrive there safely. Jeez. Ooh, Agma. Captain Agma is a fine swordsman, brave and true. I know he and his fighters will serve you well. Another thing. During your travels, you are, t you are certain to meet many who despise Dolor. Some may be hiding in villages, others may have been captured or forced to fight against their will or better judgment. Okay, this is just telling me I can recruit stuff, people. Yeah. Like, I don't really want to narrate him. Okay, so looks like that's the first chapter. Um, thank you for watching. Um, I'll be posting more soon. I'll try and make this like a daily upload thing if I can, if I have the time for it. But I'm pretty sure this episode, <clears throat> geez, I'm pretty sure this episode by itself is like 30 plus minutes. <laughs> Maybe I should just cut out some of the junk, but, but we'll see. Okay, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.